Leading local today in our top story from reckless drivers to impaired motorists. Law enforcement have plenty of things to watch out for when they're out patrolling. KX News' Guy Gregory tells us about a new tool that will help troopers and officers catch drugged drivers. For several decades, most sober driving campaigns like Drive Sober or Get Pulled Over have made people aware of the dangers of getting behind the wheel after they've been drinking alcohol. However, the North Dakota Highway Patrol says they are now pulling more motorists over who they suspect are driving under the influence of drugs. Drug recognition experts are troopers and officers trained to identify certain behaviors that are associated with drug impairment. Officers are looking for things like impaired coordination, speech and balance. Now they have a new electronic device that can confirm their suspicions. Its purpose will be to be able to utilize roadside for um, when officers suspect an impaired driving individual under the influence of something other than alcohol. So this would be specific to drug impairment. The Sotoxa oral fluid device works like this. After an officer pulls over a driver who they suspect may be impaired, they give the driver a small swab-like collection device. The driver is then asked to swab their mouth. Next, the officer connects the collection device to the electronic mobile unit that will then analyze the collected sample of saliva for the presence of any drugs. It tests for certain opioids like the narcotic analgesics. Uh, it tests for methamphetamine, amphetamines, benzodiazepines, uh, THC or the active psychoactive ingredient in um, marijuana or cannabis. And then it also tests for cocaine. Although the device can detect and identify the different types of drugs that are present in a person's system, Trooper Chase says it's not the final test taken. So this is just a preliminary test. So then after the arrest, the individual is, is still asked to, to provide a chemical sample, whether that be a, a blood test or a urine test. Trooper Chase says the new tool should be beneficial in helping those troopers and officers confirm their observations of any drivers who may be impaired by drugs. The officers are able to identify impairment, uh, but without something immediate, um, they, they can still, they still test for it and they still make the arrest, but it's nice to have that confirmation right away to know that, okay, yes, this, this impairment that I'm seeing, it is or could be caused by a drug or drugs. And Trooper Chase says the Sotoxa oral fluid device may help law enforcement confirm if an impaired driver is either under the influence of drugs or instead could be suffering from a medical condition. He adds that officers across the state will receive the mobile screening devices and begin using them soon. Reporting for KX News, I'm Guy Gregory. The North Dakota Highway Patrol says the Sotoxa oral fluid devices were first used during a roadside pilot program the last few years to check their accuracy in detecting drugs. Trooper Chase says it went well, so that is allowing them to roll it out across North Dakota this fall.